What does it look like inside an emissions lab? How do you make Ram trucks quick again? And what kind of performance are we bolting on Ford rear axles? Find out in this episode. In this week's R&D update, final testing is underway on the emissions compliant Monster Ram intake elbow with EGR for 2007 to 2026.7 liter Cummins engines used in Ram 25 and 3500 trucks. The test vehicle, a 2018 Ram 2500, is being tested for emissions compliance at the SEMA garage in Diamond Bar, California. SEMA is the Specialty Equipment Market Association. It's a trade organization for aftermarket parts companies. There, the Monster Ram equipped truck is undergoing testing for various drive cycles. Basically, they take precise measurements with lab quality equipment to ensure the Monster Ram meets or exceeds the California Air Resource Board's emission standards. It's an insane battery of tests, and I gotta be honest, it's not cheap. But it's absolutely necessary if we wanna make and sell parts in California and the other 17 plus states that follow California emission standards. The SEMA garage is available to help SEMA members, auto parts manufacturers and more develop products from start to finish. Since emissions compliance is required for almost all performance and engine based products, the SEMA garage is available to make the process easy and as affordable as possible. So it's only a matter of time now and next time we report, we should have some preliminary performance numbers, so stay tuned. In our Pedal Monster story segment, we check in with Travis Hess, a property manager who's constantly in his truck, either driving unloaded or loaded to various properties all over the West Coast. Well, he recently traveled to the Banks campus here in Azusa, California for a little upgrade to his 2020 Ram 2500 with a 6.7 liter Cummins diesel. Here he met up with me <laughs> and I ran through a bunch of stuff to show him how the device worked and how it's far safer than the competition. I gotta say it's weird with me talking to you and me also in the screen. Anyway, so the Pedal Monster is so easy to install, even I can do it. After a drive on the streets around the Banks campus, really just that street and the street behind us and the street over there, he played with city sport and track modes. Travis felt like he had a completely different truck. It was awesome being with him in the passenger seat, looking at him, watching the smile on his face as he just freaked. He couldn't believe how transformative the Pedal Monster was. That's unreal. Yeah, it's a, you can immediately <laughs> tell. That's amazing. Oftentimes, customers don't expect the amount of change that the Pedal Monster can make. <laughs> Experiencing it firsthand is an eye-opener. And if you're a dealer watching this, I'm telling you, these things sell themselves. It's that crazy. With all the effort that Rams put into the interior of the 3500, it's disheartening. What a slug it is, Travis said. And this pedal monster fixes it. In our coming soon segment, we need to let you know that we're now accepting pre-orders for the new Ram Air rear diff cover for the Ford Sterling Axle. That means we'll get our first batch from the machine shop pretty soon and we'll start shipping. The latest diff cover fits 1985 Ford F250s and 350s with a Sterling Axle with 10 and a quarter to 10 and a half inch ring gear. Bankspower.com slash diff cover for more info. And by the way, we're shooting Gail's reveal video this week. So if you're wondering why you need this cover for your Super Duty, he will explain it all. The video drops in the next two weeks. In our dealer spotlight this week, Cody Jones recently bought Family Tire and Automotive in Grapevine, Texas. Since taking over, I've added a lot of performance, said Cody, and a big part of that is trucks. Trucks are massive here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, and everyone seems to have a diesel. He recently bought a 2020 Silverado with a Duramax, and he says, I can't believe the amount of power they have to start with, but there's always room for improvement. You just have to do it right. And that's why we use Banks parts like the Derringer Tuner. And he says, in this area, there are a lot of fly-by-night guys out there that have a laptop and they think they're an expert at tuning. We see a lot of trucks come in here after these so-called tuners turn nice trucks into bricks. We become experts at fixing them. If you're anywhere near the Dallas-Fort Worth area, Go to our friends at Family Tire and Automotive. They're an authorized Banks retailer. Next up, we align our chakras and transcend our mortal coils to look back into 2009 for our time machine. The 09 Miami International Boat Show served as a venue for the Banks Twin Turbo Diesel Marine Program launch. A joint GM venture based on the General Motors 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel, the Banks Twin Turbo Marine Duramax supplied the same dependable performance, range, and durability Banks fans had come to expect. 
So will there ever be such an engine like this again? A marine Duramax? A little birdie told me something wicked is in the works. And this little birdie is 6'2 and coincidentally has the last name of Banks. And now for our new product corner. Is that what we're calling it seriously? Are we calling it a new product corner? That's, that's so lame. Hey, did you know that we make a bunch of stuff for the Ram 1500 equipped with a three liter eco diesel, monster exhaust intake, and a Banks Derringer inline tuner that adds 40 horsepower and 63 pound feet of torque? The Derringer system comes with your choice of iDash Data Monster or iDash Super Gauge that controls the Derringer and monitors every aspect of the tuner and the truck. If you own an Eco Diesel, you know RAM doesn't share a whole lot of data. The iDash shows you everything the dashboard doesn't. The Derringer works with a 2014 to 18 Ram 1500 Eco Diesel and 2014 to 17 Jeep Grand Cherokee with an Eco Diesel. If you want to ditch that nasty dead pedal, which the Eco Diesel has a lot of, I'm sure you know, add a pedal monster. I drive our 16 Ram all the time and I literally cannot stand driving it without the pedal monster. Head to bankspower.com to check it all out. Stay glued to our Facebook and Instagram feeds and be sure to subscribe to the Banks Power and Banks Insider YouTube channels. Guys, I can't say the word subscribe, it's just insane. We're here and we've been pumping out performance for over six decades. It's older than me, by like a lot. It's hot in here. Dude.